Well, thinking back um, on my association with Dr. Arthur first, several things come to mind. Um, for me, uh, trying to put into words uh, my feelings regarding Arthur, uh, are, are, I don't, I'm not sure I can do it, but I just want to say that it's so rare to meet uh, someone like Dr. First uh, to see the uh, passion that he had uh, always directed at helping other people and then to know someone that uh, can tackle the most complex uh, issues and then boil it down and explain it simply so that uh, anybody that comes in contact with him would be able to benefit from it. Uh, he had a gift, uh, many gifts, but I also, uh, I've met very few people, and I can't even think of one right now, uh, that uh, where I feel that I've met someone that uh, lived out uh, the purpose that was designed for their life. Uh, and uh, he contributed so much uh, to the world uh, with all of his research and papers and books and then to my life in particular because he laid the foundation uh, for the Neolife products uh, to be uh, manufactured and made in a way that they are made according to nature's blueprint and then of course uh, backed up by the science and him as a scientist. So we're very fortunate. Uh, I, I, one thing stood out uh, in my mind uh, always. Uh, I remember being in Tokyo and I was in uh, out in the city walking and I ran on to Dr. First and he was trying to make a telephone call on a uh, on a public telephone and I said, Dr. First, let me uh, help you. I said, here, call on my phone. He says, no, 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 no. I don't want to call on your phone. I, I, I want to know how this Japanese pay telephone works. So uh, he was, and he said, I, and I, I'll, I'll, I said, you want to ride back with me in the taxi? He said, no, 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 I'm going to take the, the trains and the subway. I, I, uh, I'm trying to learn how they operate here. So. Uh, that sums up Dr. Arthur First. Uh, you know, I miss him. And on this 100 year anniversary of his birthday, uh, the world is a better place because Dr. Arthur First lived.